welcome back. Today we're playing some more Outer Wilds and we're gonna wake up and go to space and see what happens. I still have no idea what's happening in this game. <gasps> so I think I want to go to, what is it called? Giant's Deep? I think that's what I want to do. See if we can get there, see if we can do anything there. It seems to be a place of, of interest, if you will. And we'll see what we can do there, and then we'll check our ship log to get more clues about where exactly we should go next. Here it is. Let's see what we can do here. There are things that are like floating around it, which should be interesting. Not sure exactly where we're gonna land. there. Let's try to get over there. I didn't know that there was so much water. Okay. We've landed. It was just a little scary. going down. What, 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 what is this? Oh, there are scrolls. Where are we putting the scrolls? Oh, what's happening? What is happening? What is happening? I'm, I'm terrified. I don't know what's happening. Um, okay, we found where the scroll goes. Okay. Kasava, this is it. We finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are ready to send it into orbit around Giant Steep for assembly. Our next step will be to send Brevet up to the orbital probe cannon to install the probe tracking system. To all of my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope, but I truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where many other attempts have not. Daz, are you going gelatinous on us, love? I'm delighted by your words, but they're typical for you. Kasaba, if I'm ever half as gooey as Mallow and Avens behave together, Daz, you may launch me from the orbital probe cannon. Okay. Daz, if I know my brother, Avens, I suppose that's how you pronounce it, and his spouse, will want to launch the probe with as much power as possible, I'm worried the cannon would break under the strain. I propose we give Avens and Mallow a slightly lower maximum power setting than the absolute maximum possible to create room for their enthusiasm. Okay, should we leave the scroll there or should we take it away and try to put it somewhere else?
let me just drop it here for now because I don't know if I'm gonna need my hands for something oh okay 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 the, the things are spinning things are spinning this is oh uh, this is making me so nauseous I don't want to go in the water. I, I don't like water. I, I hate water situations. I, I hate being underwater. I hope I never have to go underwater in this game because that's going to really freak me out. used <laughs> which I suppose is the point so confused contra module projection stone should we put this here Ooh. okay more text Fasava, I have bad news, Avens. Yarrow says there was a problem with the proposed power star source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. Avens, I hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here, Fasava. Fasava, I wish I were my friend, but no, they aren't certain they can fix the problem. So the orbital probe cannon is an indefinite is on indefinite hiatus. Kasaba, tell Privet and Mallow they should return from the cannon. My spouse and I will remain at the construction yard for now. Avens, an update. Mallow and I will join you in dance. Privet left to visit her brother. She fears Idea may feel responsible. I hope I'm not expected to remember like who's related to who and, and stuff like that because that's just, this is like a soap opera. Okay, well... That, that was it, I suppose, for this bit. There should be one that goes here, shouldn't there? But where is it? I feel like I'm gonna run out of time before I... I can't... I can't, like, jetpack myself up. Like, the gravity is really... Um, not helpful here. I feel like this is the type of place I'm gonna have to come back to time and time again. Let's see what's here. Is this where I came in from? Okay, oxygen. That's good. We like oxygen. Everything looks the same, though. Everything looks the same. And it's hard to remember like what's what. So I this is where I came from. Like I came from up here, right? So let's just go up again and see what we can discover up here. Okay, so that's my ship. Let's go this way. Can I even jump up here? Okay, I can. It's just hard work. Oh, okay. There's a there's so much. I feel like I need to go with my ship though. The chances of me being able to do this are very slim. Like just with my like navigational skills, very slim. But we're going to try. going oh this looks really um oh where am i okay so this is where i was no no it's not oops 
Oopsie. Okay, um, okay. We're fine. So, cockpit's damaged, so we're gonna have to fix that. Or, or are we, really? Because technically, I mean, we're all gonna die. So, do I really need to fix things, really? Realistically. This is literally where I was before, isn't it? I think I just came back. I think I just came back. So I will have to repair the thing. Yeah, I w this is where I was. I'm so stupid. So let's actually fix the thing that we need to fix. Okay, we're fine. It was just a little scratch. It was just a little scratch. It was nothing. It's nothing. Okay, so we are going that way. Over there. We are. We are gonna land. Oops. Oops. Okay, well. Um. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. That's not how I wanted to land. But, oh, oh no. Oh no, oh no, we're underwater. We're underwater. Please let me out. Okay. Again, the gravity. We probably should have landed here. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, but we have stairs. We have stairs. It's absolutely fine. This place is terrifying. Is what it is. Statue workshop. What does that mean? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Okay, we are now in zero gravity. Why? Okay. Okay, I wanna I wanna go down. I wanna go down. I wanna go down. What is happening? Like I know okay, I died. I'm gonna have to disagree with what just happened. I don't think I, I felt that harshly. Um, to the point where that would be justifiable, like the death. Disagree. Disagree. However, we were close to the 20 minute mark anyway. I, st I still don't know if it's 20 minutes exactly, but it's 20-ish minutes. So we were about to get exploded by the sun anyway. Let's just try to go back there. Let's just try again, see if we can get to another location there. Okay, let's see. We just like ooh wait a second. I again disagree that my ship needs repairs. Disagree. That was a beautiful landing in my opinion. And I'm not gonna waste my time fixing the ship unless I actually feel that I need to go somewhere else oh no oh no 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 nope 
Okay, let's just go in here. Am I just back where I was? I feel like I'm back where I was. I'm literally back where I was. I've managed to land here. Again. Let's just swim over there. I told myself I wouldn't swim anywhere, but here I am. I just, I would love to just come over here. Thank you. Okay. Oh, we found someone. Gabro, or, or Gabro, or whatever. I'm, I'm gonna say Gabro, I think that's how you say it. We've been hearing about this dude forever. Nice, it's you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? Yes, it is. So hey, don't freak out or anything, but lately I keep like dying repeatedly. Me too. I don't know, it's pretty weird. What about you? Have you died lately or is it just me? It's me too. Time loop. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah, time loop makes sense. Cool. You're taking this pretty well. Yeah. Personally, I like new experiences and I've never been in a time loop before. I mean, I don't think I've been in a time loop before this one. It looks like you and I are the only ones who can tell that time's gone all weird. I tried radioing Hornfells and asking if they died too, but they thought I was being met metaphorical. That's, yeah, that's fair. Even if I tell Hornfells about the time loop, they never remember by the next one. They, they don't realize anything's different. And here's another weird one for you. Every time I die, all of my memories from that loop replay back to me. I'm pretty sure that's related to this big stone, you know, my statue I found on one of on one of the other islands. So this, so Gabriel's like right there with us then, which is comforting. I was looking at it and the statue opened its eyes and started glowing. It replayed my memories like I, like it's seen them through my own eyes, just like what happens each time I die. Yep, same here. You too, huh? Then the my statues must have something to do with why we're the only ones aware of this time loop. So no glowing statue, no time loop awareness. That makes sense. I think that's going to be my leading theory, but if you find out anything new about the statue or the time loop, let me know, okay? I'll be here. My dude, I don't know if I'll be able to find you again. I got here, like, really by accident. Um, how's space treating you? Um, oh, so many things. I found something. No. Okay, so we, if we find something here, we might have to share this with him, it looks like. Let's talk to him again. Have you ever watched a cyclone for so long it started to hypnotize you? I'm telling you, they'll pull you in a trance if you stare at them long enough. I'm trying to stay away from them. Let me ask. I'm going to check every option here. What are you doing here? What are any of us doing here? Exploring. Okay. Second time he's mentioned the cyclone. Where should I explore? Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash in the sky. Something must be happening up there in, or in orbit around the planet. Yeah. Have you been to Statue Island? That's that's what I've been calling it. Seeing it as it's the island where I found the glowing of my statue. I was on the beach on Statue Island when the whole glowy business happened. By the way, it's a nice beach for that kind of thing. I gave it a solid ten out of seven out of ten. Okay, Statue Island. It's one with the two islands connected by a natural rock arch. This is a lot too. Like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> What's up with this planet? Giant's Deep is massive and mostly water. There's a strong current awaits beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. That's... That's good. <laughs> At least we're not going down. Four islands, including this one. And then there's the one with the statue on the beach. Cyclones, yeah. If you get picked up, try to land in water. Less likely to kill you. 
It's almost like it's like he's been watching me. Where's your ship? Somewhere. Okay. So I'm very glad we found him. Very, very glad we found him. Because every time we actually find a person, it feels like progress, like actual progress. This is very pretty. Ghost matter. Oh. I forgot that ghost matter existed, but we should be able to see it. Oh, or not. Okay. So let's not go this way. Ghost matter burns you, if I remember correctly. That's up here. Okay. That's like another camp. Roast marshmallow. I don't think this is the time. Unless this would heal me, like heal the burn. Would it? I don't see how eating a marshmallow would heal me, but... Nah, it didn't. It's worth a shot. Oh, ghost matter. This is the other side. Okay, we're just walking in circles now. Do we have to go? No. Um. Oh, the gravity situation again because of the cyclone. I don't like this at all. But I, I was gonna say, do we have to go in the cyclone? But that sounds very counter. Like, what's the word? Counter counterintuitive. So I don't know. Let's go this way. Oh, I wish this would just stop for a second. If I do try to go in one of the cyclones, and I'm not saying I will, because it's as I'm saying it, it sounds like a very stupid idea. I, I would probably do it with my ship. Not like this. Not without it. Right? Well, I probably shouldn't do that anyway. I'll just keep walking and see if we can get anywhere else on this um, island type thing. I'm just going in circles at this point. Maybe this is it for this specific island. Maybe. It's really pretty here, but it's also terrifying. Because I want to go here, but the, the ghost matter thing is just not going to let me. What happens if I just go straight through? Will I just absolutely die? Oh. Um. Yes, I will. Yes, I will. Well, now we know. Now we know. So this was this was productive because we we found someone. We found someone. Definitely gonna have to go back there many times to explore all all the islands. Oh, I'm a little stressed though. I think I'm just gonna stay here for a bit. I haven't really explored my home planet. Maybe I should just explore around here for a bit. Maybe there are things here that I haven't seen. Where it's safe and peaceful. Have I ever talked to this guy? I don't think I've ever actually talked to this guy. 
Yeah, I, I think this is my first time talking to him. All I know is between the space program and Mika's model rockets, things seem to burn to the ground around here more than they used to. That is true. This pilot seat used by pioneering astronaut Feldspar is all that remains of our inaugural flight into space. Although it's been argued such a distinction requires a breathtaking liberal definition of flight, that day will nevertheless always be remembered as a landmark achievement in Hearthian history. Now, you might be looking at this and saying, oh, she's stalling because she's scared of space. Yes. We have not talked to these people. Oh, she doesn't like to talk. If it isn't my favorite troublemaker. We wanted to play hide and seek, but Moraine won't let us borrow their signoscope because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Can you use your signoscope? Okay. Oh, the hide and seek, I've heard about this. Galena and me will hide with these radios and you use your signoscope to find us. Last one to be found wins. This is obviously like tutorial and I already know how to do this but that's fun oh uh, is that is that him behind the the waterfall yeah you've been found there's still one more though Thanks for playing with us. Uh, that was fun. Okay. I'm gonna actually um, take a look at my ship log. Just take a look to see what the next steps are, basically. Because I think we uncovered a lot today. Okay, that's a lot. Whew. Let's actually just take a look at the giant deep entries. Okay. Gabriel is lounging in a hammock. Gabriel found it on my statue. Gabriel remembers dying. Okay, so this is basically the Gabriel experience that like, we went through the same thing basically. So he knows that he's in the time loop. Construction yard. This island is where the Nomai built the orbital probe cannon. Nomai put the orbital probe cannon in an in indefinite hiatus. There's more to explore here. Yes, there is, because I think there was a second part thing that I just didn't find to translate more texts. Statue island. This island must be where the Nomai created statues like the one in our observatory. I found an Nomai statue lying on the beach. Gabriel says there's a strong current beneath the surface of the ocean that prevents anything from sinking below it. Okay. Yeah, definitely worth going back to. But should we go somewhere else before going back? I don't know. Brutal Hollow is definitely a place that, even though it was a little scary because it was so empty, well, hollow there like it says there's more to explore the nomai were able to warp here from the white hole station there's more to explore is this where the black hole was i can't remember i think so so we do have to figure this white hole station thing out i think that's what we're gonna do next i think we're gonna go back to brittle hollow and figure out this black hole white hole thing because obviously i didn't do enough there because we went into the black hole and I was just lost in space and then time ran out so I think Brittle Hollow is our next yeah that's where we're going next I've decided I've decided <laughs>